All right, Amazon sellers, you see I am in jeans today, casual shirt day, and I'm gonna be talking to you a bit. I hope it's okay with you. All right, I'm usually all suit and tied up, uh, but I'm gonna be talking today about how you can get your Amazon account reactivated, how you can get your Amazon listing reactivated after receiving intellectual property right complaints that have nothing to do with your conduct. <laughs> This is a case handled by Vincent Famolaro. He's one of our brilliant paralegals. It's our file number 05230. And I give that to you if you want to call and say, hey, I saw CJ talking about this particular case so that my team, we can pull it up for you, really discuss it with you. We don't reveal any confidential information, but if you need information on how to win this type of case, I want to make sure that you get the information that you need. We pay it forward. I'm a huge Gary V fan. Give information, give information, give information. That's the path to success. But anyway, let me get back on point here. So our client received a trademark complaint from a big brand based upon what was in the listing itself. Our client was not the Amazon seller that created the listing. So what we did is that's what we argued, that the listing pre-existed our clients even sales on Amazon, and if there was a trademark violation or a copyright violation, if whoever created that listing stole the images or scraped the images from somebody else, it wasn't our client. Now, across the United States, if you did the legal research, some states deem being on that listing to be a violation if you didn't create it. Other states say it's not. So we used that argument to get the complaint retracted because our client, number one, had great sourcing documents to show that the products were genuine. And number two, our client was not the seller that created the listing and they were just pointing the finger or pointing the gun, you know, at the wrong seller. So this is one of many different strategies that we use to get sellers just like you to get your Amazon listings reactivated, to get your Amazon accounts reactivated. If you want to learn more specifically about trademark law or copyright law, here are the two greatest books in the world about trademark law and copyright law specifically for Amazon sellers. And you can download them from our website right here. We just ask that you make a small donation to a tr tremendous charity that we support. And always, always, always know in closing um, that there are usually many ways of skinning the cat and getting your Amazon accounts reactivated and your Amazon listings reactivated. The, the goal is just doing it well, writing persuasively and identifying the best argument to use in your particular situation. PPCNinja.com was founded by Bernie Thompson. Bernie is a tremendous thought leader in our industry and a tremendous seller. PPCNinja.com uses a combination of incredible software and also one-on-one -on -one personal consultations to figure out the best PPC strategy for you to turn your advertising dollars into sales.